This is a retaining wall on Sycamore Avenue in Mount Auburn, which is splitting in half. It's one of a number of landslide hotspots around Cincinnati that aren't yet critical, but soon could be. Cincinnati geotechnical engineer Chris Hammond walked me through those this week. So a lot of these are areas that, that don't have an outward appearance of being dramatically problematic, but they do have the potential to, um, to advance into a major issue if you have faster movement, utility, Im utility impacts, and then resulting in long-term road closures. But this week, the city received a $10 million grant to shore up that spot in Mount Auburn and nine other areas, coming specifically from a fund to prevent against climate change damage in the $1.2 trillion bipartisan infrastructure package Congress passed in 2021. As you can see here, the 10 locations are scattered all over Cincinnati, from Riverside Drive on the east side to River Road. There's also another section of Columbia Parkway just around the Big Bend eastbound before Beachmont Avenue. And Hillside Avenue in Riverside has been a major issue for decades, as seen in current video and previous pictures provided by the city. Cincinnati Congressman Greg Landsman was on city council when the Columbia Parkway emergency hit. He remembers having to take money away from a planned new police district headquarters to fix the problem, and his office pushed hard for the new federal funding. Having these federal dollars come in and, and deal with these hillsides now uh, uh, by updating the retaining walls should prevent uh, those kinds of emergency landslides uh, from happening again. James Pilcher, Local 12 News. From breaking news to feel-good stories, Local 12 has it all. Tap subscribe and hit the links to find out more.